Are you going to watch a possible Spence versus Crawford fight? I'm man? definitely watching that. Oh, all right. Now, I'm definitely watching now, that. Now, 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 before you answer, don't put any bias because I know you always wanted to fight, fight Crawford. I would know now. Okay. I'll, I'll, now, I'll always answer completely unbiased. I'll give okay. you a real answer. Okay. I'll give you a real answer. All right. So, who you got in that one, man? Who I got in that fight? Yep. Y'all really want to know? Definitely. <laughs> man, I got Earl. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. I got Earl. I think Terrence, honestly, is a better boxer. I think he's a better, well-rounded boxer. But Terrence is defensively irresponsible. He gets hit a lot. He clearly gets hurt by fighting smaller guys. I think Earl is much more of a responsible defensive fighter. Um, I think he's a bigger, he's a stronger fighter, he's the stronger, he's the bigger, stronger fighter, he's gonna bring a bigger punch. I think come about seven, eight, nine, he's gonna start walking turn sides down like Jason, dropping them dumbbells on his ass. He gonna fuck, he gonna fuck around and probably catch him in one of these corners. You know what I'm saying? Dropping them dumbbells on the bag, so I don't know. So, and just one last thing for me. Um, I can't you? say this. I can't okay. say this. If Terrence is in 15-round boxing shape, the same thing that I said when Caleb fought uh, Canelo. When Caleb fought Canelo. If he was in 15-round boxing shape, he had a chance at winning. I think if Terrence is in 15-round shape, I think he'll be able to stay away from Earl, box, steal the rounds, you know, and stuff like that. Um, I don't think he'll go out there and take this fight at all.